we're gonna go over v friends v2 alpha you don't want to sleep on gary v he's fucking proved himself over and over again and you don't want to miss out let's get right into this video <laughs> checking out the channel every day we put out a new video about cryptocurrency education markets giveaways and more make sure you hit the subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss out on any content now let's go to the moon <laughs> Alpha is extremely important because you need to get whitelisted for VFriend Series 2. I think VFriend Series 2 is going to do extremely well. Everything Gary touches just turns into gold. You saw VFriend Series 1. You saw book games. So these NFTs are a little bit different and I'll go over all the different changes in how you can get whitelisted. So first of all, they are true one out of ones because they compose of different characters, poses, backgrounds, making up the complete token artwork so you can get yourself a rare and that can fetch you a lot of ethereum just like how we saw the ogres going on book games for 50 60 70 ethereum just crazy life-changing money so how are you going to get on the whitelist we'll start with the v friend series one owners if you own a v friend so one of these impressively sitting at 16.5 ethereum then you don't need to worry you are set you get a free nft so we'll go over the types of nfts that uh series one gets but you get a free nft if you own five of them if you own 10 v friends you get 10 free v friends all you have to do is pay for the gas and then you can mint them so we'll go over the type of different nfts that the uh, v1s get so if you have an admission token you are going to receive the same character but with an exclusive evolving pose if you have the gift tokens, aka the gift goats, then you're also gonna get a gift uh, a goat token for series two and a variation of two possible poses. So here, I'm not sure if these are the poses, but you'll still get those. For the access tokens, they will be retiring them as NFTs, but will continue to develop the intellectual property of these characters. Access tokens will be given a randomized evolving character when they go to claim their free mint pl uh, plus the fees of the friends series too so we will go into the supply and how you can get whitelisted if you don't get whitelisted because 16.5 ethereum is too much you know 16.69 last i checked literally just a few minutes ago it just rose so that might be too much for the average person or for anybody so how are we going to get whitelisted there is 10,255 um that are going to the original v friends series once there's 32,000 going to the friends list which we are going to cover i think this is is one of the best ways to get whitelisted for v2 10,000 for the general public so if you have fast fingers if you're going to raise your ethereum i'm going to try to mint as well and i'm going to try to get onto the friends list and then 3300 for new characters requires burning book game tokens more details to come so you can see the v friends series 2 supply breakdown and where it's all going if you own a v friends series 1 then you are set for the friends list let's get into what that is so what is the friends list it's the list of wallet addresses addresses that will get early and guaranteed access to mint within the first 12.5 days before public mint so this is how it's going to be um if you own 10 book game tokens but had two that made the 32,000 allegation list on april 5th that wallet will be whitelisted on mint to mint two series two so if you have five if you have 10 they'll be put all into a raffle so on april 5th 32,000 out of the 123,000 book games approximately 26 percent will be randomly selected to fill the friends list while it's holding the selected tokens will be eligible for the 12.5 day minting advantage before public sale so if i'm on the friends list how many v friends series 2 can i mint the number of selected book game tokens in your wallet will determine how many v friends series 2 nfts you can mint so if you have 50 book games you can win 10 of them and then actually mint 10. you won't win all 50 it just depends on the actual nfts that win do i need to hold the winning book games token after the drawing no so you can actually sell it so here's another way 
into getting into series two. This is one of the easiest ways because if we go to book games, you see the floor at 0 0.36. I think the floor was just at 0 0.5, but they just had this massive campaign on burning book game tokens to attend VCon. So you can see here how many different types of uh, book game NFTs you needed to burn to get a ticket. I believe there was about 2,200 book game NFTs burned for people to attend um, the VCon event going down. So if you wanted to get yourself a book game, there's multiple advantages because one, you could burn this book game NFT to get a new character. Um, and those new characters, some of them are getting whitelisted as we saw. And then if you own a book game, there's a 26%. I'm not sure if they took into consideration what they just burned for that uh, seven day VCon campaign. But if you own a book game, you have a 26% chance on getting whitelisted. If you don't get whitelisted from owning a V1, if you don't get whitelisted from owning one of the book games and getting lucky onto the friends list, then I think you should try the public sale and I think you should buy secondary. Usually, watching the first day for secondary you can snipe a decent price like these are 0 0.1 maybe even 0 0.05 some people even paper handed the paper hand pony for like less than 0 0.1 and it's worth multiple eth 5 10 eth who knows right now but what i'm saying is you can snipe when the day it comes out and you've seen how well gary v's products nfts his businesses have just done so this is a no-brainer for me. I actually own a pretty great book games. Its floor is three Ethereum. I'm going to hold that and hope I make the friends list. If not, I'll be buying secondary. You could guarantee that because I'm not gonna miss out on Gary Fee's products like or NFTs. He's just crushing it. So if you have any questions, if you have any tips or tricks, post them below, smash the like button, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.